let's set up the project we're going to be working on. So open up a command prompt in Windows. You simply hit Windows key and then enter CMD. And then change to your folder where you want to store your project sources. And then make directory, and I'm going to call the directory lazy hibernate. Change into the new directory, and then we simply execute a Gradle init dash dash type equals Java library. And now it takes a tiny while for the project to get created. And meanwhile, we open up our IDE to import the new project. So I'm going to use IntelliJ, click Open Project, go to our project path, and then double click the lazy hibernate build Gradle file. And then import the project as follows. Good. Now while IDEA indexes our project, there's actually two things we can do. And we can add the Hibernate dependency and our embedded database dependency to the project. So as always, let's open up our browser. And when we need dependencies, we can simply go to mavenrepository.com and look for them. So we search for the Hibernate core dependency, the only one we need to get started with Hibernate. And we pick the latest one. And then we simply copy and paste the Gradle dependency version from the web page to our build Gradle file in IntelliJ. And we're going to do the very same with our database dependency. And we're not using MySQL or Postgres in the screencast, but the H2 database, which is a Java database and it's very easy to embed and configure. So again, let's search for the H2 dependency. We again pick the latest one and copy and paste the Gradle version to our build file. Good. And just to do a quick double check if everything was set up correctly, open up the external library section and then we can see our Hibernate dependencies. There's quite a few. And we can also see our H2 dependency. And when we build the project, then everything builds fine and we get no compile errors. So congratulations, you just set up the project successfully and we're going to get right into creating the needed database tables for this series in the next episode.